a story of ideas and hope. Once upon a time, or maybe just tomorrow, a little prince crawled into the palace library. The little prince loved books. But somehow the world outside the palace never looked like the places he imagined as he read. Why? he asked the butler. That's real life, your royal highness, said the butler kindly. Well, said the little prince, I think real life could be improved. One day the king and the queen packed up the royal camper van and left the little prince in charge. The local kids decided it was time to visit. Please, can you help us? Our veggie garden is dying. We can't fill up our swimming pool. There's not even enough water to have a bath. Well, you can collect the water from your roof, use it over and over again inside, and then clean it to grow your veggies. You can even condense water from the air, enough to fill your swimming pool. Soon the kids were back again. We need better ways to get around. We're sick of sitting in the car and petrol is so expensive. Well, began the little prince, you could run your car and your whole house by using the sun or the wind. Why not use solar power and helium to fly instead? The prince hadn't been back at the palace long when... <clears throat> More visitors, your royal highness, said the butler. The little prince grinned. I think I know why you're here. He went over to the window and shouted out loud, We need to share the world! We must find homes for animals with lots of trees and safe ways for them to move around. The palace library was always busy now. It's going to be the best world soon, cried the little prince. And the sound of children's voices everywhere joined in. Maybe 